This is Gene Key, KDD Texas News. From KHOU.com, Houston police have arrested a man who allegedly shot his mother eight times Wednesday night, then shot the family cat and dog at a home in southwest Houston. The shooting happened at the Willowick Court Apartments, located in Las Palmas at West Main, around 9.30 p.m. Police said a woman who is either in her 60s or 70s lived at the apartment with her two sons. The family also had a cat and a dog. One of the sons opened fire on the mother, shooting her eight times in the chest area, and also shot the pets. The mother was transported to Ben Taub Hospital in critical condition. Both pets died at the scene. Police said the suspect, who is in his 20s, admitted to the shooting but gave no reason why. Police said he was once in the military and found an arsenal of weapons stacked in an upstairs closet. From WFAA.com, Maria Ortega opened her back door on Monday morning to find a horrific scene. She said, speaking in Spanish, I went outside and looked and the horses were dead. While they were sleeping, someone had stabbed the family's three miniature horses. One of the horses had been tied to a tree. All of the horses appeared to have been hit on the head. Ortega said they knocked them out and then they stabbed them. That's why we didn't hear them make a lot of noise. The family said they bought the horses about two months ago for their children to ride and play with. They are devastated that anyone would do something like this. Police have launched an animal cruelty case trying to find the suspects. Maria Ortega said she is now worried about the safety of her family, knowing someone so cruel may be nearby. The Associated Press reports from El Paso. Police didn't have to go far to arrest a West Texas man accused of drunken driving on Interstate 10. El Paso police say his vehicle hit a stop patrol car. Nobody was hurt in the accident early Thursday as police were directing traffic away from the scene of an earlier wreck. Police spokesman Daryl Petrie says the patrol car was unoccupied. 39-year-old George Manuel Gay Jr. of El Paso stopped after the vehicle struck the police unit. Officers arrested Gay on a charge of driving while intoxicated. If you'd like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, KDD, Texas News.